Mrs. Shelton's art room. Today we're going to be doing colorful sheep. Uh, we're going to need a pencil and some crayons, oral pastels, and some watercolor. So we're going to start with creating a big hilltop. So you're going to start here and make a big curved line going across your paper for your hilltop. And we're going to make it pastoral, which means out in pasture, so we need more than one hill. So I'm going to do another hill here, and another curved line, kind of touching that other hill, and going all the way to the edge of the paper, just like that. Now that we have them, we're going to take our green crayon, and I'm going to outline all the way over. It's okay, it's not exactly perfect. I'm going to take the other one, put it there, and final fill, just like that. Just making a nice thick line here. We're going to take our white crayon. We're going to do a line right like here. We're going to do a white crayon here. It's okay if you don't see it. You will after we paint. And a white crayon here. Now we're going to take our white crayon and we're going to make some loopy cloud shapes. Loopy, 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 loopy cloud shapes. Some cloud shapes. Alright, so we have some cloud shapes now. We're going to start doing our watercolor. So we're going to get some water here and we're going to uh, put a little puddle of water here, get some green, and we're going to start painting in our green hills. So on day two, we'll start adding in our sheep head. So I'm going to come in here and I'm going to start putting my sheep head in. And I want to start with a pencil. I'm going to make a big kind of rainbow shape curved line like this. And I'm going to come in like this. ear shape and the bottom part of our sheep face just like this. And I'm going to do this to kind of remind me where my sheep head is for when I do my sheep body. I'm going to go ahead and draw in where my eyes are going to be in like a big circle here and a big kind of oval here really. It's an oval shape. Okay. Alright, now we're going to either use some crayons or we're going to use some oil pastels to put in some circles for our sheep body. And we're going to create our big sheep body here with its curly round circles. So I want you to watch me do it first. We're going to pick three colors that are next to each other on the color wheel. I have picked three colors of red, yellow, and orange, but you might choose another colors that are next to each other on the wheel, like purple and blue are next to each other on the color wheel. So let's get started. I'm going to start putting in my big circles, kind of sheepy round circles.
cheapened and everything's dry, you can start adding some detail. You can go in and use your crayons or your oil pastels. And let's add some little grass here. You can put a sun in your sky if you want to make it look like there are butterflies flying around. You can if you want to put a little tiny sheet back here on the back hill, you can. But now is the time for you to start decorating and adding your own details to your awesome sheet picture. All right.